I mean, it works. On the inside of our big Rubik's Cube, we have uh, rollers and transfer bearings so that all of the cubelets are only touching each other through rolling friction. It's a lot longer to be able to solve this cube because with a normal Rubik's Cube, there's a lot of muscle memory and you can move really quickly because it's small friction and you have a lot of force. For this cube, every move is deliberate, so you have to m grab onto a face and rotate it completely and then remember what you just did instead of doing a series of al algorithms. So it's hard to keep track in your mind what moves you've already done as well as what moves more you have to do.